What is going on YouTube? Y'all know we have been pushing strong. We almost to the end of our 30 days of Photoshop. This is probably like day 26 or 27. Y'all know I just get my days confused. But today I'm going to show you guys how to edit toes. How does it fill in toenails? If your client's nails, toenails are not up to par how you want them to be, or they just need you to fix them, I'm going to show you how. But before we even get started, make sure you, I've been talking about this all the 30 days, right? If you knew or you, or not new here, you've been following me, go download my free editing training and my free retouching actions. The only way you can get into our five-day challenge to become a better editor is if you have those free things. Because if you don't buy the free things, well, you're not buying them. But if you don't get the free things, you're not going to invest in the regular things. So I just want you to go and invest into yourself. Now, I'm going to show you really quick how I will go about fixing it. So what we're going to do is hit Command or Control J, right, if you're on Windows or Mac. If you never edit on a background layer, we're going to use the smudge tool. So the smudge tool looks like a little finger. And all you're going to do is you can put your strength at about 50%. And how this tool works is what you do is you take the tool and you drag it up what you're trying to fix. So as you see, as I'm dragging it up, it's kind of like fixing it. Look at that. This ain't no long videos real easy. Look at that. Let's do before and after. Before, after. Before, after. Like, come on. Same thing in here. You see her nails is kind of... All I'm doing is pressing and smudging it down. Smudge tool is like pressing and moving. It's kind of in the... I feel like it's in the family of clone snap, but it's kind of easier. So as you see... Well, no, two different purposes, I would say. So as you see, all I'm doing is just taking my brush... And smudge like I'm like clicking on one area and dragging it to the area I wanted to cover. It's kind of like you putting a mask over it in a sense. But look at the before and after. Before, after, before, after, before, after. Like, come on, man. That is fire. And what I need y'all to do is I need you to take this technique. You know, I always preach. Yeah. Take my techniques and use them for yourself in your own way. Just follow the principles, right? So I'm using the smudge tool. You could turn the strength up or down. But to start off, use it the way I teach you, then adjust as you get your consistency going. Now, remember, you, the five-day retouching, certified retoucher challenge is coming up. I'm super excited. I have just finished the landing page, and I am going to go in and got a couple more things I'm going to create, but I'm going to be pushing out applications soon. So, I hope you're ready because we are getting to it with the retouching. We're going to make it happen. I'm excited. I hope you are ready and that you're excited. We're going to make it happen, y'all. So go get them free things I have first before you can even get access to that. Because I want you to have the free resources first and use the resources so you can meet me at the challenge and you are prepared. I'm Coach Jet. I'm out. Thank you.